today, I want to be a travel vlogger. Yeah, so man's in Pensliff, Lake District, by myself, because none of my friends came with me, because they're snakes, innit? So if I die, it's their fault, innit? Yeah. But I get munched off by some crows and that, and a couple of wood pigeons. Oh, you know, oh. Corey Davis, innit? That's his name, that's his government name, innit? Yeah, look for that cunt right there. That snakey motherfucker, so I thought, fuck it. I practice travel vlogging, because I'm not really good with the camera and that, I don't really hold it out properly. And I don't do it at the right times, like now. Round I'm about sure onto A66. She's been raining non stop. They got water all the way up there, yeah, just to get water. That's fresh water right there you can drink. Do you know what I mean? There's water everywhere here. But like there's hills, like, just rocks, slippery rocks and that. Do you know what I mean? You got the Romans walking around in flip flops and sandals and that, right? You might have Scottish, we're walking around in men's bags and them Nikes. Do you know what I mean? Man in boots, they're prepared. Mr. Wallace had it on lock. I don't care if he's cut him up and strung him up in all different places and that, right? He still smacked them, you know what I'm trying to say? His kill to death ratio was on. Say the route that I take that. I went on a path. I don't even know, like, if I'm on the path right now. More time. No, I'm not. I had to make a wood fire and a campfire. Just warm up my shoes or something. Alright, so every gate I get to, like look at my preps, they're dry. Just about. Every gate I get to, it's like a little puzzle, like a little, like a little, I don't know, like a little test. Do you know what I mean? Each one's different, but it's pretty much the same shit. Fucking water everywhere. Like I know from I'm just trying to multitask right now. Alright, so I'm right. right. use quick. Yeah. It's that one.
the views and that, and it's a hostel, like. You can see, like, the people that come here, like, have got money. They turn up all in really nice cars, and they're paying, like, really cheap. Just stay in a place like this. Everyone proper friendly. So it's back to the late district, but this time, instead of staying in the hostels, we try and camp out. And this time, I'm going to turn up with, like, the big group of mates. Just let everyone know. Let everyone know in late district, I'm not a loner. You know, I'm like a proper bag. You know, the many people I kept on walking past. Oh, hi, 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 oh, hi. Just like, just me. Chaswick to fucking Windermere. Eric, that's behind me right now. Fun. To be fair, the only thing you get walking up here, like top of a hill or a mountain, is satisfaction and good views. Besides that, pretty boring. Double sheet, that's it. So now I'm heading back down. I basically go, I've gone, uh, yeah, so I started from down there. I've gone all the way up there, all the way down there, then just to realise that it's a, it's a dead end, it was just a cliff. So I literally have to come back and then now I've got head all the way on there, but it's all wet marsh. So my shoes are wet. There's actually a lot of people that come to the latest shift. As you see behind me, there's a couple of people camping just behind that stone wall. And I've got people in front of me, people behind me, a couple solo travellers as well. So it's alright, it's not that bad. If you do get injured, it's not the end of the world. People around. There's no houses, there's no nothing. People that do live here, it's like you're literally living by yourself. I would like to understand, like, I would like to know why. I wouldn't mind living out here. If there was more things to do, I would live out here 100%. It'd be nice if everyone just spaced out a little bit, had to like at least, I don't know, around here, you could probably like at least, at least like a thousand yards each. A thousand by a thousand yards. That would be nice. More trees though. Don't know how long for though. There's cars everywhere. So I'm not sure if I'm lucky or not, but kind of got stranded. Made it to Windermere, 10 hours later, and got the last train, which is in 15 minutes. So yeah, man, made it to Kendall. On three boxes of cigarettes.